Baruch chapter 4, verse 3. Give not thy honor to another, nor the things that are profitable unto thee, to a strange nation. I want to give our praises and honor to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, or Ka Kodash, forgive me the spirit, to do this lesson. This will be a quick cut going into give not thine honor, your glory to a strange nation. Okay, and you got one body of Yahweh Shai. All right. In other groups, I believe that believe this, but I know back in the day, years ago, there were some people, some Israelites that had a camp. I forgot their name, but um, they were pushing this man. Okay. But this scripture I just read is a very quick cut. You can't, you can't gainsay nothing you can say. So for all you Israelites out there, okay, that's watching different camps, you Israelites that are young in the truth, that just woke up to being an Israelite, okay, that part of the truth, because just because you know you're Israelite doesn't mean you know the truth. You know, I always say this on this channel, that is the beginning of getting to the truth, of knowing your nationality. Then you can get to the truth and find the right doctrine that's coming from the heavens, okay? That's coming from Yahweh Bashem Shai to his men on the earth, to the whole nation of Israel, okay? You got to figure that out. Not just you a Jake, but you got a lot of Jakes out there that follow these camps that have no clue what the hell they talking about. Now, you have some of them that are just under a delusion because they didn't listen to us. And they really believe what they're saying, even though I'm reading what I'm reading. This is clear as day, man. The promises is not for the other nations. I ain't got to read multiple scriptures to break this down. This one scripture breaks it down for me. I'll read it again. Baruch chapter 4, verse 3. Give not thy honor. Okay, and that honor is talking about us being God's people. Yahweh Bashim Abishai's people. Okay, the chosen the peculiar people, just like it talks about in Deuteronomy 7, chapter 7, verse 6. All right, we are above all the nations. He chose us to be his people. Okay, a special people above. That's that honor, right? The Lord made us above all the other nations, not equal. Okay, so give not thine honor to another, nor the things that are profitable unto thee. To a strange nation. Right. Like being saved. We need to be saved. Okay. We need to be saved. Period. All right. Now overall. The whole world needs to be saved from themselves. That's why we're going to establish a kingdom. That's going to live forever. One law. Okay. Then the other nations are going to learn. Okay. And they're going to profit from us being saved, from us being who we need to be, okay, immortal, all righteous, so they can see the light from us and learn from us in our kingdom, okay, and the world getting changed like it's supposed to be, all right, other than that, the honor that comes on us being immortal, being righteous is not going to ever come unto them. Okay, verse four, O Israel, happy are we. All right, that's clear as day. It did not say, O everybody, O all nations on the earth. It says, O Israel, happy are we for things that are pleasing unto Yahweh Bashem Shai are made known unto us. Be of good cheer, my people, the memorial of Israel. You were sold to the nations, not for your destruction, but because you moved Yahweh to wrath, you were delivered unto the enemies. Right. So now we have to be redeemed from the enemies. That has nothing to do with the enemies being redeemed with us. They're the enemies. It's very clear. So how can you skip these scriptures and multiple scriptures? Okay. Multiple scriptures that cut. That bullshit, that one body of Yahweh Shah is talking about, okay, and those who believe the same thing, man. 
trying to give your salvation to another nation? What's wrong with you, man? And like I said, some of them are just under a delusion, okay? And you got some of them that are agents, okay? That are getting paid to do this crap, man, to confuse Jake that are waking up and you see all these different camps and you don't understand the history, you don't understand the scriptures of why it's like that and you just watching everybody and they got a garment and everybody marching and matching and all oh, the women got the head wrap and you just know that this is a place to go. The Lord set it up like that on purpose. Okay, let's make it clear. Yahweh Bashim Abishai set it up like that on purpose. Okay, he's made known in different groups. All right, he's made it obvious what they are going off on. It's the people, okay, Jake in general, that has to come real and come correct to Yahweh Bashim Abishai. Okay, you Jakes out there that are purposely ignoring the facts just so you can be comfortable where you at. Okay, go ahead. Continue that way. All right, but this is a quick cut. This is not going to be a long lesson. It's just a quick cut, man. Matter of fact, let me go back up to the top of Baruch chapter 4. I'm going to start at the top. This is the book of the commandments of Yahweh and the law that endure forever. All they that keep it shall come to life, but such as leave it shall die. Turn thee, O Jacob. It didn't say turn thee, everybody. Turn thee, O Jacob, and take heed of it. It didn't say take heed, everybody. All the nations. Edom, take heed. Ham, take heed. Ishmael, take heed. Elam, take heed. It didn't say that. Turn thee, O Jacob, and take heed of it. Walk in the presence of the light thereof, that thou mayest be illuminated. Then it says, give not thy honor to another. It's talking to Jacob the whole time. Okay, so Yahweh Bashim Shai has his man on the earth to cut anything, man, that's coming against the doctrine that's coming from the heavens. All right, so you Jakes that don't take heed and that's trying to turn your eye and turn your ear and close it and act like we ain't speaking the truth here at GMS, you're going to die, man. Because you playing games with your Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. That's who you playing games with at the end of the day. Okay, I'm going to say it again. You got agents. Okay. You got guys who just under a strong delusion because they didn't listen because of their pride. So the Lord put a strong delusion on them so that they believe that junk and they teach it. Okay. And for the other jakes that are full of shit that the Lord knows who don't really believe and that's for themselves. Okay, you're going to get swept up by it, man. Oh, look at them. They're so together. They got all the matching garments. They marching together. Everything's together. Oh, the women. Oh, they look nice. Girl, who made your garment? Oh, the, all that bullshit. That don't matter, man. You can't get saved by that. It's not going to save you. Okay, but, you know, the majority of Jake don't want to grow up, especially those who know they Jake. They don't want to grow up. They don't want to really grow and come to the Lord other than I know I'm a Jake. That's not going to save you just knowing you are a Jake. Period, man. So this is a quick cut, all right? A very quick cut, man, that you can't deny it. So it's no excuses. We got the truth, period. So any any Jakes walking around trying to pretend the other nations can make it, okay, go ahead and believe in him if you want. With that, I want to give our praises and honor to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Raka Kodash, forgive me the spirit to do this lesson. Double honors to the elders of Great Millstone. And Shalom to your Akim out there that's doing the truth in sincerity. Shalom.